Welcome to News 3. I'm Pari Cruz. Chopping our headlines, News 3 is congratulating and welcoming the 31 new members of the Suffolk Fire Department team, Class 42. The new firefighters completed weeks of intensive state certified basic recruit training combined with grueling physical training under the name of Drake's Jake's team. The ceremony paid homage to Trenton Scott Stone, who was joining the Suffolk Fire and Rescue Department, but passed away prior to the beginning of the academy. Class 42 also received their assignments at the end of that ceremony and they're already reporting for duty. Now check this out. The Coast Guard and Good Samaritans came to the rescue of a commercial fishing boat that sent out a mayday call off the Chincoteague coast. We're told the fishing boat collided with a Panamanian flagged container ship and was taking on water and sinking with 13 people aboard. The Good Samaritans boat arrived on scene and rescued 12 of those crew members. The Coast Guard helicopter airlifted the captain. Fortunately, no one was hurt in that incident. The cause is still under investigation. Now let's get a check of the forecast with Chief Meteorologist Patrick Rocky. Hey Patrick. Well, hey Pari, the weekend is here and I wish I could tell you there was going to be a lot of sunshine and things were going to warm up, but we do expect a lot of clouds and cool and breezy weather for the weekend. Highs over the next couple of days in the low to mid 60s. Sunday looks to be the warmer of the two, but only by a couple of degrees. Our normal high this time of the year is around 68, so we'll be below normal until we get to Halloween on Monday and for the first day of November on Tuesday in the low 70s, so a little bit above normal as we end the month and start off the new month. But we also are tracking rain on the way. A 40% chance for some rain on Monday for Halloween. 50-50 shot on Tuesday. We're thinking, though, the rain is going to move in late in the evening. So for your trick-or-treating plans, probably earlier is better than later. And you can see that nice mild weather for Monday and Tuesday. And we keep the mild weather with a lot more sunshine for Wednesday, Thursday, and Friday of next week. That's your seven-day forecast. Have a great weekend.